Qasab, along with nine other Pakistani terrorists, had landed in South Mumbai after traveling from Karachi by sea and had gone on a shooting spree at various landmarks in the city and killed 166 people in total. Well, the prosecution will go all out to demand the death sentence in the light of the charges against him. The 86 charges against him range from waging war against the country to murdering 166 people. Kasab is also charged with conspiracy behind the attack. He faces death on five counts, including direct killing, being an accomplice to killings, being part of the conspiracy, waging war against India, and for a terrorist act under the law. He also faces a lifetime on five counts, including attempts to murder, conspiracy, collecting arms, and under the Explosives Act. <coughs> During his arguments in the Apex Court, Kasab's counsel had contended that he was a tutor to work for Allah like a robot and not given a free and fair trial and that he was not aware of any conspiracy for waging war against India. He had also contended that the prosecution had failed to prove the case against him beyond doubts and told the bench that his right against self-incrimination as well as his right to get self himself adequately represented by a counsel to defend himself in the case had been violated during the trial.